हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई शो यू हाउ टू प्रिपेयर जिंक कोटेड अल्यूमिनियम कार्बन बैटरीज इंस्टेंट चार्जेबल लॉन्ग लाइफ इट इज इंस्टेंट चार्जेबल सो दैट इज कॉल्ड दिस आई एम यू गोइंग टू यूज द यूज्ड अल्यूमिनियम कैंस हियर आई एम गोइंग टू कट इट लाइक दिस आई एम गोइंग टू कट इट एंड इंस्टेंट आई कोटेड विद जिंक आर यू एबल टू सी इट दिस इज कोटेड विथ जिंक बाई यूजिंग जिंक ऑक्साइड एंड सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड I coated zinc inside this, so it will give long, chargeable cycles, better volt and chargeable and more also more ampere also. So this will be the negative for us. This is aluminium can, cutted aluminium can, which you can get from your house. Any used spray spray cans, I used it. So another part is the carbon electrode. This should come in the center. So with this carbon electrode, I will tie a bag. This is the nylon bag, which I have prepared by sealing. You are able to see that ceilings, the corners have been sealed. So this is a bag. I am going to tie the bag. This bag will be filled with metal oxide and graphite and carbon black powder, which I have kept like this. Graphite, carbon black, and manganese oxide. This is the metal oxide powder, which I am going to slowly fill the nylon bag. and then insert the carbon rod so i'll tie it like this i'll insert it i'm going to insert like this fill the things i'm going to slowly fill this metal oxide port into that then i'll tie it this is what i have done so because it takes little more time and cautious we will do it so i tied like this i have filled it and tied using any thread you can use any thread which is available This I have taken from the battery, so this will give you a better connecting points. That is why nothing more than important. This is this is the positive electrode. This aluminium cans which I cutted and then coated with zinc will be the negative electrode. So these two are very vital. So another one which you require is the electrolyte. Here the electrolyte will be I am going to use manganese sulphate. Manganese sulphate. Zinc sulphate will be the major. Zinc sulphate gel, you can call it. Zinc sulphate will make a electrolyte. This electrolyte is major because this will make the electrons pass through negative and positive. So the current will develop. So inside this, the gap, I am going to fill the gel. This gel I have already prepared it. This is the zinc sulphate, little amount of manganese sulphate in aqueous base. So this gel, I am going to Coat with this. Slowly, I'm. I'll coat it like this. Are you able to see it? This I have to coat with this. You can, yeah, like this. Then, at the bottom, to avoid any. Link with the negative and positive. Otherwise, the current will become discharged. So I will keep a, going to keep a filter paper inside. So I kept a filter paper inside. Then I am slowly. I will going to insert this positive electrode containing the gel fibers. Slowly will insert it. able to see it yeah slowly we have to insert this you can use any small brushes or any spoon i'll show it slowly you can insert it slowly little by little you can insert so that they become a tight pack Loosely packing will not give you current passage. Yeah, more or less we are prepared now. The excess will be once you press it, the excess will come out. Just inserting it slowly, little by little, 
so that they become enclosed into the cartridge so i insert almost i inserted the excess thing i can wipe it out and use any cloth so we have ultimately prepared the battery this is the battery this is called as instant chargeable zinc coated aluminum carbon battery so we have prepared this aluminum carbon batteries then we have to check the current which will be formed just be on the line for better performance we can use the teflon tape so that it will be tightly yeah it will be tightly yeah. I can use a Teflon tape, so it will look nice, fully prepared. So we are, we are prepared. Aluminium carbon batteries. Inside I have coated with zinc for better long life and more cycles for charging. This is instant chargeable. These are all the nylon bags we have to prepare before assembling this battery. So I will we'll check the what the voltage is now. We will check it. I will bring a voltometer. We will check it what will be the current. This will be the negative. This will be the positive. We have to see zero. Sorry, some disturbance has come. Just you can see it. We have to see the voltage. You put the voltage and I'll show you. Now I'll show you. One point seven nine. It is so nearly is one point eight. It is. You put the seat. Gen generating voltage is one point eight. So it will smoothly run the motor. Sorry, some disturbance has come. That is why it is shake. It is. Now we'll check the what will be the current flowing strength. Current. We will see the check. Again, negative. This is positive side. So roughly you are getting four hundred amps. You are getting. Now it is two two fifty amps. Two thirty amps. 230 milliampere it is if you charge it it will be go to nearly 400 to 500 250 milliampere is giving so you can check with the motor because it takes little time for to saturate once it saturate you can see better amperes you can even charge it and see it able to see motor running this is called instant chargeable zinc coated aluminum carbon batteries it will give better amps we'll charge it and see it 
just beyond the line we can charge it We'll find out what the ampere is. We'll find out. Now it is slowly. It is around 250 milliampere. You can once you charge it, it will rise to nearly one amps also. It will rise. But we have to charge it. This is just initially. This is how we can prepare aluminium carbon batteries. Okay, friends. Next time I will show you how to prepare aluminium carbon batteries using aluminium chloride and urea as the electrolyte. That also very good and very chargeable, easy chargeable batteries. These are all modern batteries which are under research for usage in electrical vehicles. This also gives very good current, volt also 1.5 to 1.8, ampere also it reaches 1 amps. So it is equivalent to commercial batteries this you can prepare in your house also okay friends thank you if you like this you can give a like button you can even pass your comments so that i can improve a lot this is cutted aluminium cans without aluminium coating thank you